What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix your crashing, lagging or freezing issues in Volheim. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this issue. Before we start right into the video, I hope I uh, would... <laughs> Um, I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really be thankful for that. I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So as the first step, I would recommend to open up your task manager by simply using the shortcut or navigating down to your taskbar, right clicking it and opening up your task manager. What I want you to do next is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner or bottom top corner, <laughs> top corner, <but laughs> top left corner of your screen, clicking on the process. I'm sorry, guys, I'm tired. Uh, clicking on the uh, processes, just to ensure that you're sticking around it. And uh, what I want you to do next is going to sound a little bit weird, but trust me, it will help you. Just end every single task by right clicking and clicking on to end task, which is currently just running in the background or just as an application for two reasons. So, first of all, um, too many programs or applications running at the same time could cause crashing, fre freezing or lagging because your PC is too bad or is a low end PC. And the second reason like it was for me, it is like that some applications and background processes are going to third party your main game causing it to crash or to freeze. Don't ask me why, but this happens and you avoid, you're going to avoid this problem by just ending every single task. Once you're finished, you should be able to click on to end your task manager. And as the next step, I want you to search an empty spot on your desktop, right click it and go to the display settings. I want you to stick on the display. And as the first step, I want you to identify which your main monitor is by just clicking on to identify. And obviously this just applies if you have more than one monitor. Once you identified it, scroll down and stick around scale and layout. We want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended. And your display resolution should be the same as in game. So for example, if you're having game 1720 by 1070, just apply this to your display resolution. Once you're finished, just simply end this task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen. We want you to open up your settings and navigate right onto update and security. Stick around Windows Update, and I know guys it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on your PC will help you with like 99% of your technical issues you're currently having, and also with your lagging, freezing, or crashing issues. And I want you to simply download the latest version of Windows just to provide the best possible performance for your PC. Once you finish, just simply end this task and do the same thing for your graphics card. So if you have AMD or Nvidia, it doesn't really matter. Just go to the application, go to the browser and download the latest driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you guys, but I'm just trying to do my best to order in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.